introduce you to the Motorola Click that we'll be selling with T-Mobile here real soon. The real cool thing about this device is Moto Blur technology that's part of it. It's a server-based solution, and you can see that it really comes to life on the phone. Photos, I can look at those. I can, in fact, poke someone or accept a friend request all from this widget without ever having to log in and log out of applications. Another aspect is updating my own status update. I can do it right here, almost essentially without doing anything. I just start type, typing, and I can say talking, and update, and when I click on that, I can do all services, or just do Facebook, or just do Twitter, and it's one click. That's good. So as you can see, updating becomes a lot easier to do. Uh, sorry, I'll turn it for you. That's okay, I follow you. You can see my update right there. I'm always aware of what my latest is. And now I've noticed I update my status a lot more. I hate to see it empty and I hate to see it old. Over here is my messages widget. The beauty of this is all your messages, whether it's Facebook, Twitter, or your corporate active sync, email, come to this as well, or my texting, is all right here. I can scroll through and view all of my messages in one spot. I see where they're from. I see the, the picture of who sent it to me, or I click on here and get a different view of all my messages in one spot. This is essentially now my Twitter inbox. But if I click over here, sorry, I keep turning it for you. You do fine. Here's an example of my universal inbox. You can see that's where it pulls together all of my different outlets for messaging, and I don't have to go in and out individually. It's all pulled together for me. A couple other things worth mentioning is let's say within contacts, to see how integrated my contacts really are. If we click on one of my friends, Tom, not only do we see the latest picture that Tom has, whether it's Facebook or Twitter, but you can see that it is connected Tom, his contact from Facebook, as well as his Google contact. Previously, that would have been two different inputs for me in my phone book. Now it's one. With Tom three. But even better, with one, without any clicking, I automatically start typing and I say, hi Tom. And I can, it assumes I want to SMS, but I have multiple ways that I can communicate with Tom. Now I can SMS, email, write on his wall, send him a Facebook message. So think of that. I'm not, again, going into the application and needing to do any of these things. It's all right there. Imagine I see Tom's status is listed right there. If I see Tom's in Barcelona, I know he might not get my text. He might be checking Facebook, though, so I'll choose to write on his wall instead. So within, within contacts, you're always connected. You can see happenings, which would be the list of all his latest updates. He doesn't have any updates, so we'd have to find someone that does. But within happenings, you see updates. Within history, you see my communication history with that person. So I would literally see all of my communication back and forth. Here's my last communication with Trevor. It was a Facebook message. Let's see the last uh, happenings for Trevor. I can see all his latest Facebook updates all in one place without, again, having to go in and look at it. So I'm caught up before I meet with Trevor for lunch. From a hardware perspective and from a software perspective, we say it's the best of Google and the web. Of course, everything you would want. Google Talk, Google Maps, a lot of the great Google applications, as well as great preloaded applications, whether it's Quick Office or Telenav, which is all available on the device. It has Wi-Fi. We also have a 5 megapixel camera, which is located here on the back, dedicated camera key, uh, a quick touch lock key, a full 3.5 millimeter headset jack, volume up and down keys, a physical key to lock for silence and ringer, and then a standard micro USB port. This device is literally quick and will be available with T-Mobile, so coming soon.